Hi, I'm Gordon Sprouts, Marketing Director at Navico, and we're here at the 2009 Walmart Open, presented by FLW on Beaver Lake in Arkansas. Now our engineers are on the water right now testing the new structure scan sonar that you can add to your HDS unit later this year. So let's go out on the water and check it out. Here is uh, the uh, side viewing structure scan. Here you'd have your vessel right here, and as we're approaching, you'll see the history coming back here. This is the bottom fan out here. Right there we see a concrete structure to the left. If you'd like to set a waypoint on that concrete structure, just go ahead and hit the cursor pad, cursor over to it, and hit the enter key, and it'll drop a waypoint right there, a rock. Since that's a concrete structure, we went ahead and dropped a rock, and you can see that now on the driver's chart, and he can navigate back to that spot so you can check that out a little bit more. What are those structures over to the left, Ryan? Are those trees? So over to the left, yeah, these are trees. They're submerged under water. You can see the, the tall shadows here. These are the trees that are actually coming out of the water to the surface when they fade off in here. You also have a bait ball suspended here. Um, a bait ball is just a school of fish. Uh, you can see it's uh, suspended above a little depression here, which is probably a creek channel. Again, we have the concrete structure up to the left. Can we zoom in on that bait ball? Absolutely. We'll zoom in and cursor down to it. And you can see, you can really tell it's a bait ball by the little the one that's suspended until you can see the actual separation of the fish within that bait ball. A lot of times when we'll see bait balls like that, we can also see predator fish uh, around them as well. Larger, larger fish. Let's go ahead and zoom back out. Exit. And we can go ahead and go back to the uh, current information the unit's receiving. There's our concrete structure again. Yes, and you can see it on both sides, so we're going over it uh, a little bit over the top of it. There's another concrete structure you can see one on the top of it, and it's stretched on both sides, the right and the left. Um, if we were to move out further out here to the left, you'll be able to see it all um, as we pass by on our left. Looks like an old road. It sure does. It looks like it's got a road with a guardrail. Looks like it might actually go over this creek channel that we have passed over before. 